I thought about um, formative films and I, in my story. And I found out that all the formative films are also transformative films, if you want to call them that way. There are very few films shot in India that have the level of abstraction that I demand. I find unforgivable to look at India in a sentimental way. You have to be much more impassive and much more compassionate than that. Well, Brunel is a bad man. Without, you know, a bad man, what would my, what our life would be? Nothing, right? And Viridian is the manifest of a bad, bad mind. Well, I am a weeper at the movies, and Viva Saviv is the movie that makes me weep the most. It's also the movie where you know that he has invented everything, but is more believable than anything you can encounter in your life. Bertolucci, for me, has always been the most intimidating figure because he was able to draw from an extremely local, cultural narrative and he has been able to pull poetry out of it and uh, I've always been very um, intimidated by that because as an Italian, as someone raised in Italy, I had to run away to find my voice and he really was able to find an extraordinary voice based on what is, was there in front of him. To see Chapaco when you have never been in America, you know, that's it, that's what America really is or should be, and is drawn my entire life. Life is drawn in there between Times Square, 1970s Times Square, and the Kumbamela. That's like the arc of my entire life.